Yo, what is going on? This is Nick. Welcome to another video. It's November. I didn't think I'd be wearing my sunglasses again this year, but here I am. Um, I'm going to head to the gym and do a workout for you. Um, I'm going to do some, some different exercises than I normally do to so mix it up for you guys. And I'll catch you in there. Let's go. So you just saw me do an alternating based workout where I'd alternate between each uh, side of my body. These ex types of exercises are good to do from time to time to prevent any muscle imbalances in the long run. So I thought I'd mix it up today, show you an alternating workout where all of my exercises I would alternate uh, between each side of my body. 
Now, the workout was far from eloquent. You probably saw my archer pull-ups could be improved, to put it mildly. But there you go, um, there's my workout for you. So I'm gonna head home now. I'm gonna cook something up. Uh, I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna eat today as well. So um, always gotta get your uh, protein and your carbs in to refuel and get stronger. Let's go cook something up. All right, so we've got pasta and kale and a bit of spinach in there as well. I'm gonna be throwing in some cheap tin tomatoes there. And I've also got a bunch of Condiments as well, chili flakes, garlic granules, parsley, mixed herbs to make it taste a bit nicer as well. And I've got uh, some chicken breast as well. So that's going to be my lunch today. Let's whip it all up and I'll show you the result. I'm also going to carve up my last bell pepper as well. All right, so there you have it. So that is about, I'd say 600 to 700 calories. Um, perfect for after a hard day's work at the gym. Yeah, so that's my meal for my post-workout meal. I really feel like the light in here doesn't do this justice. Um, it looks nicer in person than it kind of looks on here. <laughs> but there you go. So I'm gonna eat that now, and then I'm gonna take you through dessert. So let's attack this. All right, so we've got uh, blueberries, which I defrosted quickly in the, mic in the microwave. Um, I got full fat Greek yogurt because I chose the full fat because calories. Um, I got oats and finally I've got a combination of milled linseeds, goji berries, sunflower seeds and pumpkin seeds. Pretty clean, pretty fresh, pretty delicious. I'm going to eat that now. So that about does it for today's vlog. So I showed you a workout um, where I focused on alternating the sides of my body. Um, also with the bench press and the shoulder press you could see that on the, on the side that I wasn't lifting the weight, I was holding the weight in what's called an isometric hold. So an isometric hold is a contraction um, which unlike the eccentric and concentric contractions is a type of contraction where you keep the, the muscles still basically but it's under tension the whole time. Um, this kind of works the muscle in a slightly different way to doing the just pushing the weight up and down in the air um, so I thought I would make it a little bit different and then I showed you what I ate for lunch, what I ate as a post-workout meal uh, and snack. Um, you'll notice that I eat relatively clean uh, this is because I'm looking to marginalize the body fat increase and try and increase the muscle mass. So yeah, that's kind of my vlog for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe to my channel, which would be awesome. So I will catch you in the next video for more content. See you later.